Mom, we haven't had water in six days. The building smells like sewer. Marie Avila reads a letter she just got from her son Christopher, an inmate at the maximum security Connolly unit. People are pooping in bags, throwing them out the window. It's not just Avila. Several families of prisoners there describe the exact same conditions. He said that they were living like animals. He can't shower. He said that people were pooping everywhere and they were like using potato chip bags, some of them. All sorts of water-related complaints that started last week. I was like, what? I, I mean, I started crying. I mean, can you go six days without taking a shower? <laughs> I know I can't. They're not animals. The Texas Department of Criminal Justice says the problem began with the water wells in nearby Kennedy. They had two, two pumps went down, and then over the weekend, they got those repaired, and then another pump went down. For now, inmates are getting drinking water from tanker trucks parked outside the prison. As for the toilets. Nobody was going to the bathroom in bags or in anything other than a toilet. Marie Avila says she believes her son. He's not lying. I mean, they are lying. They're the ones that are lying, not my son. He's paying for what he did, but also don't treat him worse than a dog. If people that don't care about people in there, I do care. Prison officials say they care too. And in this case, we've actually had offenders thank us for how well we've managed the situation. Robert Price, Fox News at 9.